inspired you to open this center? I started martial arts when I was three years old. Um, my father taught me everything I know. Um, he came to this country from Sicily in 1969 and started taking up martial arts. So as young as I can remember, he put me in a uniform and I aspired to be like him my whole life. Um, from teaching the children to teaching the adults to teaching students with special needs, kids, it's, this isn't a job for me, it's, uh, it's a passion. My doors are open to the public. No matter who you are, everyone is welcome with open arms in my school. Um, no one's forced to come in here. You know, I'm probably the only school around that does not have any contracts. Everyone comes here because they want to, not because they're forced or they're tied into something. So when it comes to special needs students, they're all treated the same. Um, we all wear uniforms, we're all the same, doesn't matter who you are. And my son Elijah has been attending Master Joe's uh, Taekwondo class for three months. He's 13 years old and has, and has autism. He was diagnosed when he was two years old. The highlight of Elijah's week is coming to karate school. If we're running five minutes late, he's on my case. And my daughter is Samantha. She's uh, 10, oh, excuse me, 11 years old now and uh, she's been coming to uh, the New York uh, Black Belt Center for the past year and a half right now. Uh, she's now a green belt, uh, and uh, she was really welcomed with open arms. Uh, even though she was born with Williams Syndrome, uh, she's quite the character, but uh, like I said, she was really taken in and, and uh, taken under Master Joe and Master Eleni's uh, wings. You know, my uh, head instructor here, Instructor mm -hmm. Eleni, okay. is a former U.S. national team member two-time Pan Am Games gold medalist. Wow. You know, I have a lot of students here that are state champions, national champions, you know. Um, but at the end of the day, everyone has respect for each other. We're all the same. And that cohesiveness amongst the students here really is what built this school up tremendously, like you saw today. Mm -hmm. You know, we are one big family. You know, I've had students here that my father used to teach them, now I teach their children. Wow. I, there's generations of martial artists in this school. The main differences within all martial arts is they all come from different countries. You know, judo is a Japanese martial art. Okay. Kung fu, like you just said, is a Chinese martial art. Taekwondo is a Korean martial art. Um, at the end of the day, I say they're all in the same. If they're taught correctly, it's all about respect and discipline. Mm -hmm. There's different aspects to every martial art. Whereas, you know, like judo, judo is the art of throwing your opponent and grappling. Okay. There's no kicking and punching. Whereas taekwondo is, we have a heavy emphasis on kicking and we incorporate the punches as well. You know, every martial art has a different aspect, a different style of defending yourself because it's all about defense at the end of the day it's that we don't we don't promote to attack we promote to defend ourselves you know it's just different ways of defending yourselves under the different circumstances last year my father passed away and without me knowing he um, made me the lease to this school here I went to go renew my mother's lease to the restaurant and instead the landlord handed me a lease over here because he wanted me in a bigger space and in the beginning, I was very worried because I thought I was going to lose all my students that I built in another neighborhood, but they all followed. And uh, this school has grown tremendously, and uh, I owe everything to him. Everything I do is for him every single day. Wow. Yeah. It's a family environment here. It's a positive environment. Everyone is treated equally. We're all the same under one roof. Um, my father always had a saying, and it's actually on my logo. Mm. Your, your belt is worn is your belt is worn around your heart, never your waist. Mm. You know, if everyone puts their heart into this, everybody's happy. Young or old, doesn't matter, we're all the same. It's a good, positive energy. Great, wonderful. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, it was a pleasure. Yeah, it was great.